there, handsome. Hello. Hi. Let me ask you a question. Okay, what? Have I still got it? Got what? Time was, I would walk down this street and I'd feel the eyes popping out of a guy like yours head. I was H-O-T. But now, I'm not so sure. Okay, you're really attractive. Can I go now? Bullshit, limp dick. I'm not really attractive. I'm stunning. Or, I'm mutton dressed as fucking lamb. These are fucking $500 shoes. Doesn't that mean something to you? No. Well, that shows what you know. No doubt. I just got divorced. Well, I'm sorry to hear that. I don't need your fucking pity. Fine. Have you got a smoke? No, I don't. Listen. Can you give me a ride home? Get a car! I don't give a shit. Let's go, tough guy. I wouldn't have thought a girl like you would live in Middle Park East or somewhere. Honey, when you're in the fashion world, you need to be in touch with the street. You need to be able to feel what the people are doing. I grew up in Middle Park East, but I couldn't live there anymore. It's too vanilla. Some folks go on that way, too. They're expensive as well. Bullshit. I could live wherever I want. I'm taking that impotent ex of mine for everything he has. My lawyer has found so many holes in the prenup, it may as well have been written on Swiss cheese. Great. Seems like the marriage was at least profitable. I needed to get something out of it. It's not like I was being sexually gratified. Impotent loser. Christ, I was spending a grand a month just on vibrators. It was ridiculous. This is it. Thanks, Darl. Don't mention it. I'm just here to get some stuff. This guy's been fucking my brains out all week. He's hung like a rhino. Hey, you dick! That's my wife, you mean screw! Why do men oh. always fight over me? and stay down. Can I ask you a question? Yes, you're really hot. Mrs. Recently Divorced, guys with eyes on stocks, $500 shoes. Excuse me? I gave you a lift a little while ago. We met late at night. You were pretty wasted. Shit, you're joking. No. Oh, Christ. <laughs> I have to stop combining drinking with those sleeping pills. That keeps happening. <laughs> well, no harm done. Well, thank you. Listen, I know it's a lot to ask, but I don't suppose I could ask you for a favor. You couldn't run across town and get me something, could you? It's just that we've got a fashion shoot later. <sighs> Do I have to? I'm kind of on my way. Typical, so typical fucking man. When I'm drunk and you think you can feel my breath up, you'll do anything. But the minute it's daytime and I ask a normal and reasonable favor, it's fuck you, Sarah. You've got a vagina. Why should I help you? Okay.
Okay, out. okay. What do you need? Just collect a box for me from Perseus off Pyrite Street in Bismarck. It should only take a minute. Sure. <laughs> You're an angel. Bring it to Pier 45. Hello. I'm here to get a package. It's for some woman. She said you'd know I was coming? Sure, sweetie. I've got it right here. That'll be 500. Uh, I think there's been a misunderstanding. I'm just here to pick it up. I'm not paying you. Sorry, sugar. If you want the package, you're gonna have to pay for it. That's the way things work. Please, don't hurt me. I'll give it to you. I'll bust your fucking head. Here's your package. You're a lifesaver. I don't know what I would have done without you. 